I mean, I always felt like the Wicked Witch from the East coming in, but you know, I had a ball doing it. And like, I have, I was like the, one of the funnest moments in television ever, I think that entrance, Addison's entrance. And you know, I gotta ask, there have been uh, so many Grey's Anatomy cameos over this past season. Uh, people have absolutely been loving it. Would Dr. Addison be up for a return? I know that they said that they reached out a while ago, but have any talks been happening lately? I haven't heard anything else, so I don't know. Honestly, I haven't. I mean, I guess they'd have to have me zoom in at this point, but I haven't heard, but I was so, I was actually thrilled and thought it was incredibly clever the way they brought people back, you know, during Ellen's, um, was it a coma? Is that what she was in? Yeah. Like a coma? Mm -hmm. I mean, it was, what a great device that was. I mean, honestly, I thought it was just awesome and chilly and hugely moving and really cool. You know, to take like a, you know, a very kind of, I would say cliche device of a, you know, coma and the hospital drama, but then make it this amazing thing where, you know, you've got Pat and TR and didn't, did Eric come back too? Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. yeah, it's just so cool. It was really cool. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I would have loved to do it, but you know, I'm in a different hemisphere right now. So. Totally. How would Addison have felt about Meredith and Derek's, you know, wedding? And did you know, did you always want to see them have a happy ending? Oh yeah, I mean, I always felt like the Wicked Witch from the East coming in, but you know, I had a ball doing it, and like I have, I was like the, one of the funnest moments in television ever. I think that entrance, Addison's entrance, and uh, and it, you know, it turned out to be a great, massive, um, beautiful experience for me uh, in so many ways and, and brought me uh, so many opportunities and growth and I think made me a better actor, the ability, the good fortune to go to work every day and just keep practicing and practicing. And then really it brought me to where I am now and a sense of somewhat of, uh, you know, place to be able to use my my name and my energy to help um, bring awareness to campaigns like this one with Sheba um, and and have a good fortune, especially in my place in life now too, is I just want to help wherever I can. Yeah. So, um, so yeah. Definitely. Great do, you, do you think Addison and Jake would still be together and happy? Oh my God, I have no idea. I hadn't thought about that. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? She really, uh, it was fun. I mean, that that's part of the big, the fun fantasy of that, of Shauna Land was, you know, being like having, being double board certified and, you know, wearing, you know, <laughs> Jimmy Choo's and in Prada. And then like, you know, I could, it's like, what couldn't Addison do? Well, she couldn't really, she, and then also like having a tour of all the men. It was very funny. <laughs> Was that opening scene where you know you you said, "Oh, you're the woman screwing my wife." Was that your favorite scene that you ever shot? Maybe it was certainly the most. I think it was the one that I got the most attention from, and, and you know, up to that point in my career, it was like, "Oh, wow!" That thirty seconds got a lot of notoriety, so it was pre it was pretty cool.